Hydro-Quebec's power lines cover a huge territory. You may have noticed that under some of these lines, we clear a corridor called a right-of-way, where there are no buildings or trees close to the power lines. Have you ever wondered why? Well, it's to keep you safe and ensure reliable service. Let us explain. Let's start with the basics. Inside your home, the electric wires have a voltage of 120 or 240 volts. Because these wires are covered with an insulating sheath, you can touch them without getting an electric shock. However, some wires outside the home are not insulated. This is the case with distribution lines, with a voltage of up to 34,000 volts, or 34 kilovolts, which is abbreviated KV. There's no insulating sheath around transmission lines either, and their voltage can reach 765,000 volts, which is 6,000 times greater than the wires in your home. Therefore, to prevent vegetation from coming too close to the wires, Hydro-Quebec must clear the entire right-of-way. Overhead power lines are generally less costly to build and more advantageous from a technical standpoint. They are insulated simply by the surrounding air. However, for that insulation to occur, a minimal distance must be kept between the wires and everything around them at all times. Here's an example. A tree is growing beneath a transmission line. Over time, it comes too close to the wires. Even if the tree does not touch the wire, its presence can create an electric arc. An electric arc may trigger a power outage, start a fire, or cause serious injuries. To ensure everyone's safety, nothing should come near these power lines. Not you, not your tools, not any part of a tree during pruning or felling work. There are several types of power lines. Distribution lines run through our neighborhoods. The wires at the top of their poles do not have an insulating sheath and their voltage can reach 34,000 volts. During work, a minimum clearance of 3 meters must be kept around these wires. That means nothing can come within 3 meters of these lines. Because they carry electricity over great distances, transmission lines have a higher voltage, ranging from 44,000 to 765,000 volts. They are more imposing than distribution lines, and their support structures come in a variety of shapes and heights. Transmission lines require more clearance than distribution lines. Therefore, to prevent vegetation from coming too close to the wires, Hydro-Quebec must clear the entire right-of-way. As shown here, the higher the voltage of the line, the greater the clearance required, and the wider the right-of-way. In transmission line rights-of-way, Hydro-Quebec promotes the growth of low plants, such as grasses and small shrubs, to reduce the risk of vegetation coming too close to the wires. A well-cleared right-of-way prevents accidents, outages, and fires. It also makes access to the line easier for maintenance teams and for emergency teams in case of a failure. In addition, in the event of a forest fire, a clear right-of-way acts as a fire break, protecting the line from damage and slowing the spread of flames. Hydro-Quebec specialists are in charge of planning and selecting the methods for maintaining rights-of-way. The work is carried out by qualified companies whose workers are trained to comply with Hydro-Quebec safety criteria and technical specifications. Hydro-Quebec specialists also determine what activities can be safely practiced in a right-of-way. That's why you need Hydro-Quebec's written permission before undertaking any kind of work in a transmission line right-of-way. For your safety and to ensure reliable electricity service, vegetation must be kept away from power lines at all times.